Radio. Oh, a little inside tickle. It's that lovely bit of flight. Lynn will be a little edgy. It's dark brown in colour, an indication that there is a little bit of extra moisture there. Just might grip a bit for the spinners. That's the biggest challenge as an opening batsman facing a slow bowler early up. Not quite sure if it's going to run on, just grip off the surface. Most vulnerable time as a batsman when you just come to the crease. Oh, crazy. What an anti-climax, Lenny. Out inside the power play, let alone the first over. First one down, and it's a duck and a half for Chris Lynn, courtesy of Mohamed Nabi. Second time being dismissed to Mohamed Nabi. Fifth time to a spinner. Spoke about that grip, that slowness. He was reaching for it, both arms away from his leg. And a plan coming to fruition. Zooks, they strike. First wicket down. Lynn without scoring. He does like to go early. His most top order players have got to make the use of the power play to the max. Got a slip and that's uh, Rakim. Well, this will uh, liven up Nubby a bit. He won't mind the lefty in to go away from him and then to get it to slide in. El Dorado drone, what a classic. The, Sky cam and a half. Oh, yes. The Eldorado celebration. Ah, there it is. Tommy Moody, we love this game. Out early. The lefties called it from the back of the box. Oh, my. You can't keep this man out of the game, Mohammed Nabi. Make that wicket number six for him overall in the tournament so far. Gets the new man, Nick Kelly, goes without scoring. It's none for two now. It's time for uh, Dennis Ram and all that experience. The right-hander back at the crease. Lynn, gone. Right-hander. Kelly, left-hander, gone. Ooh, one to negotiate for Dennis Ramden. There is the first run for the Patriots. After one, it's one for two in these conditions. I'm liking it. I'm liking your aftershave as well. Oh, yeah, keep that social distancing. Mm. Mm. Smelly, but nice, nice smellies. Well done, Darren. That's enough, that's yeah. enough, yeah. And these services, well, it's your backyard, DG. A little bit of turn, moisture, 10 a.m. start. As expected. You need to be a little bit watchful, play the percentages early on as a batsman, get yourself in. Ramden would have had a fair amount of experience playing here at the Queen's Park Oval, so you know. Early morning, there is a fair amount of moisture. And you've got to make the adjustment for it, quite frankly, as a batsman. Big pitching wedge. Oh, has it gone all the way? Hero Max, and there's our first one in match 15. And when I talk about playing the percentages, it's for a shot like this. Ramden, he's assessed. Nabi is turning the ball into him as a right-hander. And he could afford to use his feet and get to the pitch of the ball and hit with the turn. There's no long on, so that's taking minimal risks. He's also a nice little worker of the ball. You mentioned him the other day. He sometimes just gets a bit bogged down. He also plays a nice paddle sweep. Good percentage cricket usually from Dennis Ramden. Going with the tie. Hey, hey! Oh, another one down. 
were just saying, his patience has run out early here. Third for Mohamed Nabi. Now that is totally different from the previous shot. There is a deep backward square, there is a deep mid wicket, so that's a lot more risk in taking that option. Wrong decision by Ramden, and he pays the price for it. Gone for nine, 11 for three. Three down very early, and we haven't quite had three overs. So we've got Jamar Hamilton, who's come into the uh, Patriots side. So strength here because of wickets. Left-hander in. Darren Sammy himself has gone into another slip-catching position. Smelling the dominance here inside the power play are the Zooks. Confidence riding high. Crazy stroke after just pumping up Dennis Ramden about his experience and patience and nous. The Patriots are imploding here. Evan Lewis, the key man in this Patriots batting lineup. Only his second ball of his innings. A top edge to short fire leg. And this is not looking good at all for the Patriots. Lewis goes for one. It's 11 for four now. Oh, and it just goes over the head of Darren Sammy. Leg slip. Four for ten, Navi's previous best in T20s. He's been very good for the Zooks in this spell. Accurate. He's been able to make the adjustment for both the right-handers and left-handers. Slider that goes straight on. So yeah, just keep everyone guessing with bats in hand. Only ever been seven five wicket hauls in the history of the Hero CPL. Fifers only on seven occasions. Come on, Muhammad Nabi. They'll be saying there in St. Lucia. Rodney Bay kicking back with the sun out. Restaurant time, seafood. Ah. Spinnakers. Here's that quicker one. Well negotiated by Dunk. Well, Dream 11, he'll be all over this. Will the Afghan star? You haven't downloaded the app, do so. Dream11.com. Check that all out. He's certainly all over the MVP. It's Muhammad Nabi. Oh, he wants it. Nice soft hands and a good call. Good response from Hamilton. We saw Dennis Ramden be dismissed earlier. I question that approach because what we've come to know of Dennis Ramden is his ability to rotate strike, but risk-free. He didn't do it on this occasion. Tried to be the aggressor in the partnership with Evan Lewis. That is what led to his demise. Back at home looking on. Live cricket entertainment is a rarity in these times. So all and sundry must be complimented for the effort in getting the cricket to you, the viewers. If we drill down to the cricket itself, yeah, we want to see a little bit more from the batting, but it's been entertaining. And that's what you want to see. Players being challenged in different departments and developing as they respond. But throughout the tournament, he's been dominant with ball and bat. In the air, and this could well be another one for Nubby. It's a handful for him. There it is, five for Nubby. 
Mohamed Nabi's first five wicket haul in the Hero CPL. What an achievement. It's the eighth five wicket haul in Hero CPL. That's a tremendous accomplishment for the right handed off spinner from Afghanistan. He's been consistent, he's been brilliant with bat and ball for the Zooks. And yet again today he's starring. So Il Tanver goes for 12. And the Patriots in deeper trouble now, 70 for 7. Nabi, he can do no wrong. Alzari Joseph, the new batsman. We've seen a few batsmen in this innings get dismissed playing that sweep shot and getting a top edge. Evan Lewis won. Ramden tried the slug sweep and top edge. Patriots will try to eke out as many runs as possible in these remaining overs. Four runs from it and a wicket to Mohamed Nabi. It's 73 for seven.